こんにちは、あつです、えー、今回はですね、えー、私はちょっと面白い文法に関するネタを持ってきておりましてこれをオンライン英会話のキャンブリーの先生にちょっと聞こうと思うんですけれども、えー、このネタはですね、まあ、皆さんきっと知ってると思うんですけれども、えー、何々のように見えるっていう意味の「It seems that 文章、ね」えー、でありますよねこれに関するお話です。で、まあ、it seems、まあ、皆さんよく、まあ、見たりとか聞いたりとかねしてると思いますし特に会話とかあとは it seems like とかよく使いますよねでこれの否定形否定形否定の形ありますよね it doesn't seem that 文章 it doesn't seem that 文章であると思うんですけれども、えー、この時の that ざっと説の that っていうのは省略できるのかっていうことについてねちょっとと聞こうと思う思んですねで何度もオタクのような、ね、細かい話なんですけれども、まあ、なんでこの話になったかというとですね、まあ、私の動画に昔ね出たりもしてくれたディスティンクション制作にも携わってくれてるアンジューっていうねイケボのオーストラリア人がいるんですけどこの人とこの前話してた時に、まあ、私は正直に言うとこの「It doesn't seem」の時も「It seems」の時もこの後の「that」説のいわゆる「that」の部分っていうのは別に省略してもいいと思ってたんですね思ってたんですけどこの前「It doesn't seem」で文章を言った時にアンジューが「うんなんか It doesn't seem」っていうその否定の時は肯定の時はいいんだけど否定の時は「that」を抜くとなんかちょっと不自然に聞こえるっていうふうに言われたんですね。で、なんじゃそりゃって思って、で、これについてちょっと自分なりにいろんな人に聞いてみようっていうふうに思ったわけですね。で、まあ文法的に、いわゆるその文法書的に正しいのかっていうのは、個人的に正直それはどうでもよくって、あの、実際にネイティブの人が本当にみんな、ダットがそこにないと不自然って感じるのか、えー、それともそれってアンジューがオーストラリア人だからなのかとか、まあ、人によって違うのかとかそういうところがねあのちょっと興味を持ったので少しまあ趣味の一環としてこれで遊んでみようかなというふうに思っていますで、えー、今回ですねキャンブリーでイギリス人の先生にちょっと聞いてみようと思いますのでその様子を皆さんご覧ください All right, Hatsu, how are you? Today,、um... yeah. I've got a few questions. Yes, fire away. You don't have to give me the exact answer, but what I'm expecting is your like, personal feeling about it. This is about a like, um, typical structure that native speakers often use, but it seems like something. Like, it seems like. It seems like. Okay. So、yeah. that's. That, okay. And then. And then often a sentence comes after that, right? Yes, yes. Yeah, it, it seems, seems like. like It's going to rain. Yes, correct. So it seems like it's a very typical structure, and we all know that you know, that's very often used, and that's fine.、Yes. So that's ticked off. The question around it is there is another form similar to this without like. So it seems that some, it seems, it seems that. that sentence. My question here is is this that necessary? And you're asking if that is necessary. Yeah, so that's a, that's a very first question. That is、okay. necessary or not? And the second question is like, it seems that is this structure common in the first place? Like, do yeah, people yeah, actually yeah. use it? Seems people do. They use that、yep. in conversation. Okay. But in it, I would say, in, I, don't, I don't say it seems that. I say it seems as though. For example, if I'm trying to think of an example. But it seems as though sounds like already like it seems like, but sounds a little bit yeah, more. Yeah, it seems、formal. like it seems as though. Yeah. Yeah. How about it seems that? That, that is also common, that is used. Yes.、Mm-hmm. Usually when talking about it seems that he is upset, like you said earlier, it seems that she, usually when talking about another person. Okay. Two people are having a conversation about a third party. And how about it seems he's upset? It seems he's upset. I think it seems that is more common. That's just、mm. on, my, on my personal experience. It seems he's upset versus it seems that he's upset. Yeah. 
that's a difficult one to tell. Yeah. You know, they're, they're both correct. They are both correct. correct. Neither of them are grammatically incorrect. Right. Does the latter sound a little bit unnatural or not really? No, that's natural too. That's perfect. That's natural, natural too. Okay. Yeah. Just depends who's speaking and where they're from, possibly. Without that, it works. Okay, so that question solved. Good. The next question,、uh, yes. which is a little bit more juicy.、Um, so, when you say it doesn't seem, yes. For it example, doesn't it doesn't seem. seem he likes it, for example. It doesn't seem he likes it. No, that's incorrect.、But、it doesn't seem that he likes it. How about that? The reason I was asking this question is my Australian friend, right, told me that when you use it seems that in a negative sentence, like it doesn't seem that, that has to be there to, to make it sound natural. If it's、said. negative, it doesn't seem. If it's seem, negative, that has to be there. It doesn't seem that she is happy. It doesn't seem that. Yeah, okay. Uh, I kind of agree, but I would also say it doesn't seem as though. As though. Okay, so give me the situation and I will tell you how I would say it. Let's imagine a situation where you give a piece of chocolate to your friend next to you,、uh, okay. maybe in the party or something, and then he didn't even touch it. And you think that, oh, this person actually doesn't like chocolate, right?、Okay. And then you. Tell your friend next to you, oh, it doesn't seem like he likes chocolate, does he? Or something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, what would you say? I would say that. It doesn't seem like he likes chocolate, does he? Ah,、uh, okay. It doesn't And... seem like he likes chocolate. But it's, I'm not sure how correct it is because it doesn't seem like he likes chocolate. Yeah. So grammatically, I don't care. Like, I don't care about grammar. So I'm, you, I, now you're I'm, going on to more natural how people exactly, exactly. That that's、yeah. what I care. Yeah. So how you、okay. feel about it, then that's more important than grammar rules, yeah, in my、yes. opinion. Yeah. I, I would say to my friend, it doesn't seem like he likes that chocolate. Yep. So that's what I would say as well. But is it okay to say, for example, it doesn't seem he likes chocolate, does he? It doesn't seem he likes chocolate. No, I would not say that. It doesn't seem that he likes chocolate, does he? That's more. That's correct. I'd say that before. <laughs> See? I, yeah, that I would. That's the that. point. Yeah. So that's But, what's making all the confusion. Who? Where, who is the confusion with? The confusion is that you know why、Using. that has to be there in a negative sentence, whereas in a positive sentence that. Doesn't have doesn't to have to、there. be there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I I see where you're what you're getting at.、Um, mm. I wouldn't say it.、Uh, I would use that in the negative. I would use it. Right. But it doesn't. Say,、mm-hmm. It doesn't seem he likes chocolate. That's not correct, is it? Wow, interesting. Is it I, again? Is it, sorry to keep, but I would say it doesn't seem as if he likes chocolate. Is that what you'd you'd actually say? Yeah, I think I'd say that. Okay. It doesn't. It doesn't seem as if he likes chocolate. Not because you pay too much respect to your grandmother. No, my grandmother. I'd say it doesn't seem as though he likes chocolate. Right. <laughs> but, but maybe me. I would say it doesn't seem as if he likes chocolate. Ah, as、That's、if.、It. Yeah, yeah. Wow.、Well, yeah. That's how I would say it. Yeah. Still. Yeah. It has a bit of a British flavor to me. Perhaps spice things up. You could use the the Australian and the British. I think. I think we are starting to form a consensus as to you know、uh, the use of that in the negative sentence. It has to be there. It feels like that is fine. It does need、mm. to be there. You can't just take away the that. Yeah, that's incorrect.、If、right. You just take away the that. Yeah, because、um, I think you know this topic is really、um, uh, common、uh, in a grammar class. Sometimes we are told that okay, this that is omittable. So, like in a casual speech, people omit it or something like that, and then we tend to just omit all the that. The native speakers told me that、oh, it doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't sound natural. It doesn't seem like it's correct. And I'm like, hmm, okay, that's interesting. And then we started like digging deep and deep and deep and trying to figure out okay, yeah, how yeah, things、I'm... work really in、yeah. native speakers' mind. Then another question. So let's see if this is the case only for. This structure. So there is there are so many other similar structures such as、um, it appears, right? Yes. Okay. How about it doesn't appear 
that versus it doesn't appear sentence. So it doesn't appear he's the man versus it doesn't appear that he's the man. Personally, I would say it doesn't appear as if he is the man or it doesn't mm. appear as though he is the man for the job. So neither of them is correct. For me the personally, I would, I would not say that. It doesn't seem... Are you saying... So what did you say? It doesn't appear. It doesn't no. appear... It doesn't appear that... It, it doesn't appear he's the man that we were talking about. Well, first of all, it doesn't appear is not something that I would actually normally say in a casual speech, I guess. Yeah. If you, Maybe. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't appear... It's not it's, as common. It's not that common, but it is mm. still used. People, yep. people do say that in a formal setting. In a, in a formal setting, you're, you're more likely to speak like that. Does it sound natural to your ears or not? So Okay, say it one more time, please. It doesn't appear that he's the man. I mean, yeah, you can say that. You can say that. How about, it doesn't appear he's the man. You can say that too. Okay, me, so would, without that, it still doesn't... sounds natural. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't appear he's the man for the job, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it doesn't appear he's the man for the job. I suppose that's the quickest way. And a lot, lot, most people like to shorten their sentences in a, mm. if, you're, if you're just speaking generally. Okay, but in the case of it doesn't seem, without that, it feels weird. It doesn't seem that, it doesn't seem he's a man. It doesn't seem he's the man. Hmm. It's, it's tricky. The problem with this is you could ask different, 10 different native speakers and get 10 yeah. different answers from that's, native That's what speakers. I'm doing. That's what I'm doing, yeah. <laughs> literally. Yeah. <laughs> um, in your opinion, personally, right? Yeah. So I'm not trying to get a definite answer. Okay, you, just your personal opinion is more than enough. Yeah. So in your personal opinion, it doesn't seem that sounds natural. It doesn't seem without that doesn't sound natural. It doesn't appear that sounds natural. It doesn't appear without that also sounds natural. Correct? It doesn't appear that blah, blah, blah. It doesn't appear. Let me talk it up for you so to give you a lot of headaches. That's all right. I'm used to headaches. <laughs> It doesn't seem that... Let's put he's the man for the job. For the job? Okay. Mm -hmm. It doesn't seem that he is the man for the job. It doesn't seem he's the man for the job. It doesn't appear that he is the man for the job. It doesn't appear he's the man for the job. It doesn't seem he's the man for the job. That's fine too. It doesn't seem he's the man for the job. If you were speaking quickly... If you want That's to just fine. get your point across quickly, you can say, it doesn't seem he's the man for the job. You can say that. Really? Yeah. If you're, if you're trying to get the point across quickly and move on with the conversation. But didn't you say that he sounded unnatural? Because I think that the end of the sentence also affects the beginning. So if, we, if we're saying, oh. yeah, like he's the man for the job or it doesn't seem talking about the weather it doesn't seem like it's going to rain today how about he likes chocolate it doesn't seem that he likes chocolate it doesn't seem he likes chocolate okay it doesn't seem that he likes chocolate that's fine it doesn't seem he likes chocolate no that's not fine i would say it doesn't <laughs> seem it doesn't seem as if he likes chocolate it doesn't seem as though he likes chocolate oh my gosh like, I honestly think that the the next part of the sentence can actually make it sound natural or unnatural. It depends on what you're talking very about. Very interesting. Yeah. That is very like, interesting. If you're talking about the weather or you're talking about a, a plane journey or a train journey, it could be completely different. And it may, in some situations, sound natural and in others, sound unnatural. If a sentence like, it's going to rain, comes after that, then it doesn't seem like sounds most natural i think because there is so much uncertainty there like when you're seeing like you know clouds moving and getting darker it it seems like it's gonna rain it seems like but you don't yeah. know so that's why it seems like sounds most natural and that makes yeah, sense yeah. yes but like in the case of 
he likes chocolate versus he's the man for the job. I don't really see a big difference between those sentences. Yeah, I suppose he is the man for the job. He does or doesn't like chocolate. He likes or doesn't like chocolate. Yeah. They are pretty much the same thing. They I are, mean, they are. Okay, um, interesting. But I, yeah, thanks I, for your I, thoughts. My, yeah, my take on it is that the, the, the second part of the sentence will affect how natural the beginning mm. sounds. はいということで、えー、先生に聞いてみたんですけれどもすごいちょっと面白いこと言っていてこの「that」が必要かどうかっていうのはその後に来る文章でちょっと変わりそうだななんてね、えー、ことを言ってましたね面白いですねそんなこと考えたことなかったですねでまあアンジュの場合は、まあ、その時はまあ大したねいろんなバラエティの例文について話してないから「いや doesn't」シームの時は、えー、ダットがあった方がいいみたいなね、えー、もうそれだけだったんですけど、今回ちょっといろんなバラエティの文章を試すと、ね、そういう結論になりましたね。で、これってもしかしたら、たまたまこの2人がそういうふうに思ってるだけかもしれないし、ね、えー、人によって違うだけかもしれない。地域によって違うだけかもしれないし、もしくはネイティブみんなが基本的にはこう思うっていう。えことなのかもしれない。わかんないんですね。なので、まあこれ、まあ私はもう英語学習は趣味なので、この趣味のまあ延長線上として、いろんな人にこれからもちょっと聞いてね、えー、どういうことなんだろうっていうのを探っていけたら楽しそうだなぁなんて思っています。で、今度ね、あのよく出てくれるニックとかにも、えー、ちょっと聞いてみようかなぁなんて思いますので、その様子とかも今度動画にできたらいいなぁなんて思っています。それでは最後まで見ていただきましてどうもありがとうございました。また次の動画でお会いしましょう。バイバイ。